a scary moment for three rafters on the Gallatin River on Thursday. As they went through the Mad Mile approaching House Rock, their boat flipped, putting them all underwater. All three of us were trapped under the raft. For, for me, it sounded like, felt like forever, um, but it wasn't really the case. And we eventually got out and got out of the stream quite quickly and spent the next 15 minutes uh, tracking down the raft. David Kletter considers himself lucky to be alive after he and two others were forced into the rough Gallon River when their boat flipped. There's a few things that like flashed to my head. I'm all like, you know, what's going to happen here and get out as quickly as I can so I can survive. And uh, it was scary. It was one of the scariest moments of my life, I would say. And I'm still in shock. You know, my heart's beating fast and starting to feel my injuries, but it's, it was scary for sure. Several local law enforcement agencies quickly responded to the call of a flip boat along the river. Uh, initial response was search and rescue from the Big Sky area as well as uh, the Bozeman area. I was quite surprised. The sheriff came out and the fire department and people were super willing to help out and get our raft back, so that was quite nice. Clatter adds that it's thanks to being safe with the right equipment that they survived this event. Both of us said if we without the life jacket, we wouldn't be here today. After the rafters were able to get out of the water, the next task was chasing down the raft, which continued to float downstream. It ended up all the way down here, more than a mile downriver from where it had flipped. Reporting along the Gallatin River, I'm Adam Bell, MTN News.